We had to go Parker Ream on hand as the Warriors try to get their first win since 2016 over Liberty Ranch Baseball. First inning, Joe Ortiz slaps it up the middle, but a great play from the shortstop. Cade LeCompte getting dirty and making the play from his knees. Nothing doing for Galt in the first. In the second, Larry Peruca opened up the scoring. Oscar Romero on second, and Larry scoots it up the first base side. Fair ball, and Romero comes around to score to put Galt on top one to nothing. They keep it going in the third now. Joe Ortiz up to bat again. He gets a hold of that one, hits it deep towards right field, and drops in to bring in another run. And the Warriors jump out to a 2-0 lead as Mason Tosano comes on in. In the top of the fourth, Liberty Ranch trying to get something going with a runner on first and second. Maximus Adversalo takes one on the dome. Glad he's all right, and the bases are loaded. His toughness paid off. Next batter, the ball gets away, and Nathan Nelson comes in to score, and the Hawks are on the board. Bases loaded again later in the inning. Two outs, Kate at the dish, hits a dribbler to Chris Pamplona, but he gets the force out at third. He's smooth with it. The quick step, and the inning is over. Still 2-1 to one Galt. The bottom of the fourth, Peruca gets the base knock to left, and then Enrique Hernandez makes contact to drive in two more runs to put the Warriors up 3-1. to one. Then we continue in the inning. Joe back at the plate. He hits it just out of Cade's outstretched arms, and two runs are coming around to score. Galt takes a 5-1 to one lead, which they also did on Wednesday before the Hawks scored eight unanswered. Can Galt hold on this time? Spoiler alert, Tyler Little was on the mound, and he was determined not to let that happen. Happen. Strikes out Hunter Maberto, and the Warriors are inching closer. One out in the seventh now. Galt can smell victory over their rivals, but Cade slaps it to right field. Looks like it's going to drop, but right into Larry's glove. What a snag as Galt snaps a 16-game losing streak versus Liberty Ranch. I caught up with Joe after the big win for these seniors. Well, I feel like we still got a chance. You know, if we come out in the last few games of the season, we win them all. I feel like we can still make playoffs, so... Uh, this was our last season, last time playing this team for a lot of us seniors, so, you know, we had to come out here and put on a show. 